Well, we're out here at Spilltop Gladys City Boomtown because it's spring break. And you know, you plan for spring break, you look forward to spring break, and then midweek gets here and your kids are looking at you saying, I'm bored, and you wonder what to do. We have answers for you right out here at the Lamar University campus. And I have with me Mark Osborne, who's the director out here at Gladys City Boomtown. You guys are having uh, Heritage Days. What, what are Heritage Days? Well, the Heritage Days, uh, last year actually during spring break, we had so many people come to, to visit us and we didn't have any kind of activity. So this year we said, well, let's put something together that uh, will give them something special to to do while they're here. Right. And so we've come up with Heritage Days and what it is, is it's a really an activity. It's a special tour, a self-guided tour that they can take as they go through the buildings and learn the, uh, about the other industries. Oh, learn, I think that's a bad word to use during <laughs> spring break. Well, we, we learn and we have fun at the same time. There you go. <laughs> but, uh, and uh, about the other industries in Southeast Texas that have helped the economy, things like the lumber industry, rice farming, ranching, railroads, and shipping. So, and how they're connected uh, to Spindletop and to some of the historical figures in Spindletop. Because this little museum is really a replica of uh, the town that was built around the, the gusher. And yes. so they will go from place to place like we're in the general store. What will they do in the general store? What can they see here and do? Well, the, the connection here is, this is where we'll mainly talk about the rice farming because behind you is our rice thresher. Okay. Uh, it uh, dates from the early uh, 1900s and once the, the rice plants uh, were uh, harvested, harvested uh -huh. and dried, then they would be uh, threshed and so that you'd get the actual rice kernels and that's what they would use. So. Okay, so they'll come in and they'll see the connection to rice farming, which we still have so much of yes. here in the area and are known for. What are the other buildings and things that they'll learn about? Well, actually in each building, we're, we're, we'll highlight something, for instance, in our uh, Gladys City Company building, that was the first oil company that tr attempted drilling at Spindletop. The president of the Gladys City Company in 1892 was George Washington Carroll, who was a lumberman. So he had lumber mills here in Beaumont before he got into into oil. So there's our there's our connection to lumber. And our in the barber shop we'll highlight the importance of the railroads bringing people to Beaumont, all those thousands ah, of people they who had to came. Get their haircut. Well, sure. <laughs> Once they got here, they wanted to look good, didn't that's they? That's right. That's right. So, so in each building, we'll find a connection uh, through our shipping, but also through the ships, like our our Lamb's Print Shop, the Lamb family. You know the. Um, passengers and immigrants who came in on boats so so it's there's a little bit of a connection in each building we'll find that for them and fun fun learning is yes. what it's all about yes one time we had some students here and this uh, one one young man said um, I'm having fun and I'm learning too it's, so who knew who yeah. knew you could who have knew do both? you could do that <laughs> okay in the museum you'll also do the um, enactment of the the gusher the reenactment yes the Lucas the gusher. gusher reenactment out here in our field next to the monument we'll do that Tuesday Wednesday and Thursday at 10 30. all right so Spindletop Gladys City Boomtown, just one of the places you can bring the kiddos this week during spring break. You can look on southeasttexas.com under events and find other things like the Nederland Heritage Festival that's going on, the big carnival out there. And also there's Art Quest at the Stark Museum of Art. So have a great time with the kids. They can learn a little bit, have fun too, and uh, enjoy their spring break. I'm Shelley Batanza with Southeast Texas Live. We'll be right back.